As another season of cheer, merriment, and praises for the birth of our Savior, Jesus Christ, is upon us, it is time for reflection on the year which comes to an end. We will all agree that it was a trying year, but also a year of achievement in Castro South as we strive to strengthen our constituency. Despite the limited resources, we were able to celebrate International Women's Day, to promote sports, to host our second Cicero pageant, host our own carnival event, assist children to return to school with bursaries and school bags, celebrate Emancipation Day, host our second June Equiol, and for this season, host children parties, a fruitcake and sorrel competition, and on Christmas Eve, host a solo in Bassas Joseph. It has not been easy, but I promised that I would work relentlessly to make a difference in the constituency, building on the hard work of those who served before me. As we journey into 2019, we must thank God for life and for the many blessings bestowed upon us. We pray that we will have the courage, strength, and faith to face the challenges which will be before us. Next year will test our resolve. With your support and encouragement, I will be ready to represent you with dignity, decorum, and effectiveness. I know we can build a better Castro South and a better St. Lucia through love, respect, and care for all. This Christmas season, is an ideal opportunity for us to reflect on the life and example of Jesus Christ and for us to dedicate ourselves to be more Christ-like in our behavior. Let us make this Christmas season more than drinking and eating, and instead, let it produce the finest example of our Christian values. Let us look out for and share with our neighbors and family, forever letting our humanity shine. I wish all my constituents of Castro South and the people of St. Lucia a Merry Christmas and a prosperous New Year. God bless you.